<laughs> hey, look at that. I got like four four of them pushed all the way in. That's Oh, oh. Oh, look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's the little notch there. Oh, so there's so it's notch like that and then inside when you turn them, so they all interact with each other that way. Yeah. Oh, very cool. So I don't know if let's see if we can uh see this. Um, oh, as I shake the top camera, but you can see inside there, that uh, you can see the other ones as you move them, it kind of closes the space off. Right. So then this goes in and like, huh, that's neat. I like that. Puzzle time. Episode 14? 14. 15 maybe. Or do what's the puzzle challenge? We shot a video. We're doing the puzzle challenges now as a separate episodal thing. So that's going to be episode one of puzzle challenge that we did last week. We're just calling it puzzle challenge? Yeah, call it puzzle challenge. We should shoot a puzzle challenge today actually. So yeah. Today we have got one of the best looking new puzzles that we've seen in a while, I think. Uh, it's called Taiji. Taiji 69 puzzle. Yeah, bad choice. Yeah. Not our choice. No. Um, the guy who made it, called Ai. 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 Something like that. One of the designers. <laughs> Chose it as a nickname. Bad choice. Should we just jump into that one? Let's just jump into that. Get right into it. The Right into the good stuff. So, uh, yeah. Super cool box, also. Yeah. Right there, you can see. Okay. It's magnetic on the front, magnetic front, so flip her open. Oh, don't lose your film there. And inside, you'll see, uh, yeah, the uh, Taiji. Taiji, yeah. <laughs> Keep wondering if that's his name or the, the puzzle. The 69 puzzle. Um, have, you figured, have you played with this one yet? I haven't played with it, but I did actually see the solution. <laughs> so yeah. It's, it's good. It's real good. And it's heavy, heavy duty, right? This is, is it aluminum? This is aluminum, right? So, yeah. Hey, what's yours coming apart so much there? But if you turn it, you can kind of get that little separation there. Right. A little bit of space between. Oh, yeah. 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 Huh. You saw how this one's done, though? Yeah, I did. It's, it's cool. You'll notice that um, these things spin. So each of the little eyes or whatever you want to call it spin. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, what level is this? It's a level, level eight. eight. Level eight. See, I thought it was harder. I, I heard it was eight. I thought it was harder than eight. I don't know. I when, After seeing the solution, I'm like, that's... I don't know. That seems more than eight to me. Yeah, well, like, I played with this for a little bit, too. And as soon as you figure out that, like, okay, this does nothing, then you got to figure out what else works with it. And it seems like the twisting these things is the only way to get anything. Yeah, moving. I mean, obviously, yeah, you'll see... You'll see that, but it's it's just a beautiful puzzle. Well made. Uh, this guy's new, hey? I, I don't think we've ever had anything by him. Um, again, Puzzle Master finding stuff that you will find no, nowhere else. But uh, I'll tell you this. Get this puzzle while you can because I, it, it's going to be sold soon, man. All it's going to take is someone like Chris or Mr. Puzzle doing a video and it's, it's gone out the door. So uh, for those of you who get frustrated when stuff is sold out on our website, man, Get this while you can. I'm telling you, it's going to be hot and it's going to be gone. So, uh, yeah, really cool. Great box. What's the actual, like, the on the Puzzle Master site, what's the what's the objective? It's like... Take, I just take just it apart, take it put, apart it put it back put together. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's four pieces, right? Four pieces. Four pieces. Yeah. Great puzzle, though. Great puzzle. So let's move on to away from the Taiji by Ai. <laughs> How do you say that? I don't that? know that was, if that was his first name or his last name. 
Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. The 69 puzzle, though. they told us. Uh, let's do this one. Actually, yeah, let's do this. Do this one? Okay. This is Tony. So, I mean, for those of you who don't know, uh, Tony shoots review videos for Puzzle Master. So if you're on the Puzzle Master site, you will see a review of the uh, log jam here. And I have not played with this, but Tony, Tony has. So you take it away, dude. Let's uh... see. Tony has a new style of review. So let's let's see the new style of like the new Tony style review. review. Okay, yeah. doing it live. It's Tony's personality, right? The other one is just him being like kind of static. This is Tony having fun. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. Do you want me to like just do a, do a review, do review on this yeah, thing? Let's, okay. Let's see. Let's see Tony's live review. <sighs> Are you ready for this? <laughs> this is the log jam. A wooden puzzle from Puzzle Master's wooden puzzle line. A wooden puzzle for you to take apart from Puzzle Master. This puzzle, made of wood, one cube, one, two, three, four, five, six sticks. Eight. Remove the sticks. Dude, there's six sticks in here. Okay, you're right. I'm wrong. <laughs> Eight. There's six. Sorry, keep going. I'm, I'm interrupting. <laughs> <laughs> keep going, keep going. You're take in the, the zone. sticks out. Put the sticks back in the box. The log jam. The good, simple good. review. Yeah, good, right? yeah. What level is it? Uh, nine. Level nine. nine. Level nine. So it's a hard one. See, I would not think this is a hard one. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Like, once you pull out one stick, you can kind of see, like, the inside of the puzzle, and then... Uh, Have you pulled out one stick? Yeah, you can figure out how to get one. Well, like, there's it. one with just let's one notch one. on it. So, like, what... Are they is... notched inside, then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's incredibly hard to get apart, just because once you see the inside, you'll kind of understand what I'm talking about. Right. Because it just looks like somebody took a drill and just went in a bunch of different directions with yeah. it. Let's see if we can get one. Pull one out. we got to be able to do this. Gotta Show the one. people the interior workings of this uh, log jam puzzle. Dude, yeah, and then in the in the review that I did, I had one that I had a stick pulled out of and then one that I was actually showing because I couldn't get it back together. Huh. <laughs> so... Yeah, I don't know, I, I'm still not understanding what it actually is on the inside. Yeah, so all of these kind of interlock, right? And then there's a maze on the inside as well. Right, so okay. each of these sticks have little notches on them on the inside. Right, uh, so you're trying to line up the notches so that one of these things can come out. And then once you get the first one out, you can pull the second. Right. And this is Puzzle Master branded? Yeah. Do, 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 do we say who designed this? I mean, obviously someone has, but... Let's see if it's uh, on the box. Does it say? Nope. No. Dude, you can send a self-addressed stamped envelope plus two dollars <laughs> to Puzzle Master for getting the solution. Yeah, we are the living in the store. <laughs> you do that. Where you can do email too, or uh, we know. used to do puzzle uh, solution booklets. Or you could buy a whole booklet for like 10 bucks. Yeah, and, yeah, and they'd print stamp. them, and then yeah. it'd be like, yeah, I think we even stapled them here, man. It was, yeah. Not the way it's done today, right? Yep. And I can get stuff going, but I can't get it out. You can't, can you? Dude, this so, is a level nine. This is these... far beyond our capabilities. Well, obviously, yeah. We know that. <laughs> hey, look at that. I got like four four of them pushed all the way in. That's... Oh, 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 oh look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's the little notch there. Ah, so there's so it's notch like that, and then inside, when you turn them... So they all interact with each other that way. Yeah. Oh, very cool. So I don't know if, let's see if we can uh, see this. Um, oh, as I shake the top camera, but you can see inside there. Uh, you can see the other ones as you move them, it kind of closes the space off, right? So then this goes in and like, huh, that's neat. I like that. Yeah. That is that's better than I thought this puzzle was going to be. Yeah, that's, that's, really cool. that's good. Yeah. Now we got to get back to the start. Though. I know, man. I like <laughs> once I play with these things, I just can't figure it out after. Yeah. Jeez. So then, yeah, then you can start. Like, I bet you could start feeling kind of where the notches are as you, as you play with yeah, this. Yeah, but then I like I'm not sure whether like once you get the all six out, do they have to go back in the same holes? You know what I'm saying? I don't think so, because it's just a straight drilled hole, right? It's not... Yeah, well, this one is, right? But, like... There's other ones that yeah, aren't? Yeah, it opens up a little bit. Like, if you were to get this one out first, this side is a little bit more open, so you can see more into the box. Ah. Huh. Wow. Okay. Well, let's just, uh... 
Maybe put these aside so for now. Puzzle master. Okay. Yeah, give them back. Taking them apart. So that's uh, yeah. What is it called? Uh, Log jam from Puzzle Master. It's a level nine. It's a Puzzle Master branded. So that's our our wood line. Our little uh, boxes there. You can see. Yeah. Do they come with a solution? Uh, Tell me we didn't put the solution. We did. There's sure a. Sure, it does look like the solution. solution in the box. Come on, Puzzle Master. We need that two dollars. <laughs> okay. Next. Um, do you want to just talk about what's going on in the Puzzle Master now? Yeah, let's take a break here. Yeah. What? The... Uh, we got the Kickstarter orders in. So if you ordered from our Kickstarter, that should be coming out right away. We got just over a thousand orders with that man. Like the stack of paper is nuts. We've been working <laughs> solid at it for yeah. like two days now. That's crazy. Tony does orders when he's not shooting videos. So yeah. Uh, so we've been trying to take a dent out of that. Get dude. you some puzzles. And then Aaron did a solution. Aaron, he's done, he's done a bunch. Yeah, he did a solution on. Actually, the one we're talking about today, loopy right? Loopy box. He, loopy box. Oh, it's right. Oh, that was that's the, the loopy box. Yeah. yeah, loopy box. That's the one Mr. Puzzle did just recently. Mm. So if you want to see the loopy box, check out Mr. Puzzle. That's a Constantine puzzle. Yes. And uh, yeah, you can check that out or check out Aaron's solution on it. It's on our Facebook page, our, our uh, YouTube channel, sorry. And uh, Aaron has the um, solution to the loopy box. It's a great puzzle, actually. You you like that one, eh? Yeah, it was pretty cool. It was good. Yeah. It's different, uh, yeah, I don't know. Every puzzle is a little bit different, so it's like you try path A, and when that doesn't work, you got to figure something out. Yeah, well, this, this one's magnetic, really cool. right? It has yep. like a magnetic ball that you put around in different spots. It's a puzzle box that opens up. Yeah. And then also another one that caught my eye this week was uh, Puzzle Guy. And again, Puzzle Guy, he is does some great videos, man. He's like um, kind of like a similar to Mr. Puzzle, I think. And he did Jigsaw 19. So if you like that air, uh, Uesaka stuff, um, Puzzle Guy has a great video on Jigsaw 19. He shows you the solution, I think. Yeah. And goes through it. Uh, that Jigsaw Puzzle 19 is great. It's that one of 19 corner pieces. It's a green puzzle. Yeah, I like that one. All right, let's do this one then. Yeah. All right. Last. This again is one that Tony did a review on. If you want to see, actually, on our Facebook page, there's a, a fun video of Tony almost taking it apart <laughs> accidentally. I really on tried video. not to. Yeah, this is this is one that's a little scary. Yeah. Go super for it. Cool. Uh, yeah. I don't know. This thing is uh, it's uh, got a hollow center on it. Which usually like has a ball or something in it that you need to get yeah. back in, but uh, you can yeah. hide something in this puzzle. Yeah. So this one is uh, it's made of six pieces. The pieces look like this. It says six identical pieces. Hmm. Oh, they're identical. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. So I wonder if this is. Uh, I wonder if this is the solution. In there. So is it? Th it's kind of. Uh, no. <laughs> no, it just there shows you the pieces. So if you cut this in half, I bet you it's like so three pieces on one half and three on the other probably then, yeah. right? So they yeah, so you together. can actually uh, uh, kind of show you. Yeah, try, I saw you take it apart on the video. Yeah, so you can kind of start. How do you how do you start it? Edges there, and it starts to spread apart. Right, so you need to solve oh, this thing go. all at once. It's not piece by piece. Like it all has to come yeah, apart, it's, and it's then like, it comes back together. It's like slideways. Yeah. And the cool thing about Vinco, hey, is like. Look at yours. Yours, I don't know if it's a different wood or just a different wood grain, but yours is like distinctly a little bit different than mine as yeah. far as the, the look of the pieces. Yeah, man, that's it's got some <laughs> very cool designs. Huh, I like that. Vinko's good stuff. And you've done, you've been doing a uh, shooting reviews of Vinko stuff recently, yeah. hey? Yeah, I like their puzzles. They're at a moderate price point too, so it's not uh, too crazy. Uh, a bunch of different types of wood that they'll use on there's two really unique designs. Um, not quite as high of quality as like Pelican or stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, essentially a more affordable like Pelican. Very cool puzzles. Yeah, more affordable Pelican. Yeah, some of their stuff you'll pick up and you won't even understand really how it's even put together. There's one that uh, it's shaped like a like a two. If you took like two ice cream cones and put like the tops of them together, and it's oh, really? apparently like four pieces, but it looks like it's all turned on a lathe. And like I just I was playing with it for like an hour, man. I couldn't wow. figure out nothing. We should uh, we should play with that one next week. Yeah, huh. he's got some really cool stuff. And so this is Blesk. Uh, what level is this? Uh, he has it as a level four out of five. So Puzzle Master, I think it's a level eight or nine. Eight or nine. Hmm. So yeah, I don't imagine it'd be super hard. No, but... I'd be finding out how to line up the pieces. Yeah, I think that's the biggest thing. 
But if it's similar, like that's the thing I find with some of these sliding ones that if they're the, if it's the same piece repeating, I find it's a little easier to almost figure out like a pattern because you can like see it a bit. Yeah. But if there was like I don't know a few different pieces in here, it'd be a little harder. Yeah, which the, it's you six unique shapes, so yeah, it'll be a little bit different. Hmm. That's cool. That's a great design. This is actually one of the best design puzzles I think I've seen from from Vinco. Like a really cool design. Yeah, that's awesome. Blesk. Okay, let's uh, let's move on to this big guy. So I was walking around Puzzle Master today. We were just looking for stuff to shoot, and I saw these in the corner. Phylos Cube Edition Two. So this is yeah. uh, there's a bigger the... one. This is, is that the edition one. one is the bigger one? Oh, no, edition one's bigger. So you, you crack this sucker open, and inside is... Oh, it's just it's all the cool. individual ones. Yeah. yeah, so it's got some of Phylos. So Phylos makes, again, kind of similar to Vinco in times, types of similar stuff. Um, wood puzzles. But, uh, yeah, this is a great, great design. Like, you, you get... I think you even save money, probably, on the... On the buying them individually, mm -hmm. I think with this, and you get this sweet box, which actually has like this uh, felt inside or whatever. Yeah, and then it's just got like a, here in the top. You'll see there's a whole uh, description of each puzzle, the level, um, and then you know some other languages. <laughs> so yeah, it tells you a bit about them. I love this. This is a great design. It's a heavy duty box, well made. Um, and just a neat, uh, neat extra thing that you could get if you wanted to, to get into some of the Philo stuff. I've never really done a ton of their puzzles, but um, yeah, cubes that you can take apart. So really, I uh, really a neat thing. I don't know. We, have you been? Have we been selling a lot of these? Have you seen? Uh, we don't sell a lot of them, but like, I'd it's say a one a week type of thing. Yeah, it's a little more expensive. It's one of those bigger items. So I mean, generally with these, we don't hold on to them long either. Yeah. Too, it seems like they go pretty quick because we don't, we can't order a ton of them, um, just because they're so heavy. It is, yeah, it is a great, great little gift though. If you're looking for something for Christmas, it to be a cool thing to rack up, wrap up and give to someone. So, yeah. That's the uh, Phylos Cube Edition 2. I don't even know what, what levels are those. Yeah. Uh, it's a range uh, of difficulties. Yeah. I don't know. On, I don't know what. English? No, it's definitely some German. So. Okay. Yeah. I'm not sure what the difficulties of those are. It's a range, though. So there'll be some easier stuff, some harder stuff in there. Yep. Yeah. Keep an eye out, guys. We've got lots of good stuff coming in. Um, check out our YouTube channel so you can subscribe there. Hit the little bell to get uh, notifications on our new videos. Check us out on Facebook. You can like us on there. And then also on Instagram, you can follow us. So, uh, yeah, uh, we have one of our guys doing some cool stuff on Instagram. We'll show you some of the pictures, too. We've got, uh, like you said, we've got this new camera up top here that shoots some really cool videos. So, uh, we're going to be doing some just some cool videos and short little clips of puzzles and and stuff around the shop here. So, yeah, check us out there. And, and uh, you got plans to shoot any any cool review videos or stuff uh, this week? Bon, dude, we got a ton of shipping to do. <laughs> yeah. The shipping for Kickstarter. Fun. Yeah. Cool. Well, thanks for watching, guys. That's episode... 14? 14. 14. Of Puzzle Master Puzzle Time with Puzzle Time Tony and Tyler. He's Tony. I'm Tyler. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later. See ya.